Now let's begin the tour. Stop by the tea area. In case you didn't hear what my little soft-spoken daughter said, she was introducing the fire pit area. Okay guys, so we love this area. We use it all the time at night and it also help, keeps the mosquitoes away. So it is a great area. And I'm so glad we added this area back here. And here's what it looked like before we added the uh, stencil bricks and the little pebble stones around the bottom. Okay, so my daughter was supposed to help me introduce all the areas, but she quit already. So let's move on. Here's our outdoor living area and we sit out here a lot and watch TV. And guys, this uh, patio set came from Facebook Marketplace. All right, so let's talk about this fireplace and we're gonna ignore all of these cords hanging down. I need to find a better way to kind of hide those. But the TV is on a swivel mount, so it kind of will actually swivel around uh, several areas uh, where we like to sit at. So that's a good thing. And also the TV cover came from Amazon and it is a 32 inch. This is the other side of the fireplace. And on this side is more like a lounging area, like maybe some bathing because these are reclining chairs on the other side. So this area right here kind of reminds us of like when you are at a restaurant and you sit outdoors, a oh, girl, bye. Anyway, here's an overview of some of the areas that you just saw. Over here is our grilling station. Um, this is still a work in progress because we have some more items that we need to put over here, but we can't really decide. I know right here where the shelf is that's going to be an outdoor refrigerator and we also getting a bigger grill maybe and that table will be a longer table so it will actually extend all the way out to the end of the stencil pavers over here and my husband did put a cover on the top of up here because when he he's when he's grilling that son be like baking his head in the back of his neck so and we're going to ignore these cords hanging over here as well. Um, I got to do better when it comes down to hiding all of the cords. So, All right, so here we have our bar area, which is very popular when we have events. Because you know why everybody wants to hang around the bar. And we also move this little uh, high top table and this area becomes the dance floor. So it's very functional over here. And guys, here is a picture of what it looked like before we even added the bar and the other patio. And let me just mention that this bar also came from Facebook Marketplace. So y'all do not sleep on Marketplace. Okay, so over here in our picnic area slash kids area. Yeah, we throw all the kids over here because, you know. Keep them out of grown folk business. So we'd be like, go sit your behind over there at the picnic table. Go ahead on. Okay, so and in the corner over here, we have a little smoking section, you know, for the smokers or whatever. Guys, we also know that the grass needs to be cut before anybody says anything. But we have actually threw out grass seeds. So we are waiting for maybe um, three more days before we cut the grass. So the area over here is pretty much complete. Um, we do have some minor things that we have to address. Uh, was that a bird? Okay. So as I was saying, yes, this area is pretty much complete. Um, we have to finish up our grilling area and I have to kind of expose, not expose, but I have to kind of put up some cords, like kind of hide the cords so it don't look all tacky looking, but this area is pretty much done. And we are very proud of it. We are proud of the work that we've done ourselves, you know, because it wasn't easy, but we stuck to it and we got it done. And 
here is what the backyard looked like before we did anything to it. Just plain open space, nothing. Nothing was out here, absolutely nothing. Here is when we actually finally got started on the project and we put this uh, outdoor uh, little patio area out here first. Then we added the fire pit area and the fire pit came from Lowe's, if I didn't mention that before. Um, all of our fencing came from Lowe's. All of the metal, aluminum, whatever it is called, came from Lowe's. Pretty much all of the building supplies came from Lowe's, except for the all of the pavers and the concrete. It actually came from the con concrete company. So, yeah, guys. I hope you guys like the project so far. We have to finish um, it up, and we... Uh, well, when I say finish it up, that just means that we have to finish the rest of our yard because we still have so much yard left that we are going to be adding some other things to it. So there will be probably maybe like three parts by the time I'm done with our backyard tour. So here's what it looks like when with me standing up on my deck. Okay, so here is the yard that we have left to do which it is still so much yard if it was up to me we wouldn't have any grass because i'm just not about that grass life but on each side of our storage we'll be having a heat and a she shed right here this vehicle has to be moved that is going to be a little uh, guest house in that area and i am going to uh, beg my husband for a pool because i really want a pool I think a pool would just set it off, but you know, neither one of us want the maintenance of a pool. So we are still debating about that. And so up here in the picnic area, we are thinking about uh, kind of expanding the concrete pavers on out up under the picnic table. But y'all, that was a job because our yard is on a slope and leveling those pavers. I am not about that life. So yeah, we have all of this yard that we still have, you know, just different options that we can do. So be looking out for more videos. All right, so here is the view at night with the lights on. And y'all, when I tell you we are obsessed with the night lights, like it is just everything. It is so relaxing, so romantic. The only thing is we do have to have a lot of the uh, citronella candles lit. Um, you know, any little thing that'll keep bugs away. But it does its job and we just sit out here with no problems, just being relaxed and just loving it. So, yeah, guys. So that completes the tour for right now. Um, I'm just headed back out, getting ready to go up my stairs to my deck so I can take it on in the house. And this area down here will also be included in my next video. Um, this is just a little open space before you enter the backyard, before you go up on the deck. And this uh, deck decorating will be in a separate video as well, so stay tuned for that. And I just want to thank you guys for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Until next time, guys. Toodles!